Okay, here I am at 3421 Hidden Springs. So this is in the newer section. This is in um, Dry Creek Ranch. Things aren't as mature yet. This is what your surroundings Sorry, My car's in the way. But you got the hills right there. So this, um, you just head straight out there and you'd go down that um, Cartwright Road like we got here when we came. Not when we left, but when we came to get to work, that is. So this is east. Well, that's east, so it's kind of almost east to east. Walking right in. process of moving. Nice big area. Big lights, I'll turn all this on. So nice and bright in here. Light share shades. Right here you've got a door to a little office they're using as a baby's room. So it does have a full closet so it could be used as a guest room as well. It's got this pocket door, or you know, the, the barn door slider. Um, I think it's more used for an office, is the, what it's supposed to be. Just trying to find these. There we go. This is granite, it's kind of a leathered granite. Nice use of space, microwave, oven, six burner range, all of its Bosch, cabinets to the ceiling. Brandon's tall, maybe he could reach that top one. Here's the backsplash, just a nice, it's kind of got a little texture to it, a little sheen. I like that a lot. Very gently lived in. And then here is the pantry. Yeah, you can tell there. I think this is how they live. <laughs> Now, and then this is where the dining goes. But this was my main concern because this may be you got this nice patio area. It's covered, but I think that sun will be. This is your yard. So even though it, this house is here, it's not their yard. They have a gate to get back to access that stuff. So their property line somewhere, but they probably never enter this, but this is all the yard you've got, but you do have the hill beyond that. And what they're doing there is um, they're developing up there. So when they do that, they move the earth and then you see those rolls of stuff. That's just to kind of get the grass, the natural grasses growing again um, for erosion and everything. So that's a pretty small yard. And nothing is mature yet. But very private feeling back here. Mm. I'll come back to get that closed. Turn it 
I mean, this way, this is freaking me out because I don't know if I'm in here alone, but I think I am. Coat closet. Here's the bathroom. Secondary bath. Black fixtures. Can you see that? Here's the tile. And then here's bedroom number one. All the doors in here are the, um, I don't know, eight foot doors. They might, they might even be nine because these have got to be at least 10 foot, eight cell foot ceilings and these doors are really tall. Super cutely decorated. Look at little spiders up there. It's cute. You guys need that? Gotta find you that. Carpet's in great shape. This is so gently lived in. And then here is your master. I think they're packing it up and moving. And they're just gonna leave this empty. So that's notched in. Can you see that? There's like a little notch in there. That's just a mirror. Oh, she's got a little pup in here. Hi. You're okay. So walk in at the loo. There's a vanity. This one's hard because it's so dialed in. It's like brand new home. So it is lacking the yard. It's one of those things that you have to make outside your little playground. I'm gonna video a couple of things. Hey buddy, you're okay. You're okay. Hey, you're okay. Hi little guy. How you doing? How you doing? Oh, you okay? You okay? Yeah, you're okay. Nice. Dual head. Needs some cleaning. It just needs to be bleached out along the edge. But this has kind of got that sheen to it as well, that tile. Here's the backsplash. And it's got all that storage here for linens and baskets and whatnot. And then separate room for the loo with the window. Night night, buddy. They've got the blackout shades in this. They probably have the blackout shades in all the rooms because they have a little baby and then they've got that little girl. Here's another linen in the hall. And then this is a little hard to see because they've got stuff on it, but just a little mud area. Put the coats, dump it all. And then over here, you got the laundry. Hmm. Oh, this is dialed in. This is hard for me. I would say, <laughs> This has, I would say this has less yard than, well, definitely less yard than school, how rich or whatever. And then I would say it has less yard than settlement had. But sorry, I gotta get my shoes because I'm gonna go out the garage. Whoops, whoops, I don't know what's going on, sorry. Whoops, sorry. Something's not right with this. So I'm gonna have to help it a little. That is um, definitely private, but I don't know. I don't know how tall those bushes go. I don't know if those are laurels or not. You'll want something kind of 
private or um, tall to grow. Just um, I don't think that side yard would ever be used by a neighbor. Sorry, my my kibble's not working anymore. So oh, this isn't working. I'm not sure what's going on. There's a garage. So two car, a little deeper. Let's see where this goes. Oh, very cool. Okay, they enclose this. So they've got this little space where he works. Um, no window, but if you wanted to put a window up there, then you could use this as the office. But I like this. This could also just be, um, you know, a place to get away, do yoga, put, oh, exercise. If you want your equipment in there, that'd be perfect. Okay, I'm going to come out here. Open up this gate. So this probably isn't anything you hike up, but, um, and I don't know if it really compensates for not having a yard, but you have all this behind you. There might be homes up there, but there will be nobody right here. And then as I go through the neighborhood, I'm gonna show you that too. I'm gonna show you, um, I'm going to show you um, just kind of what you're, what's surrounding you. I'm going to close this. That's, I got a dog. Stepped out for gas barbecue. Hold this and I'm gonna drive for a bit. You got a huge common area back there that I'm gonna show you. Sorry, I don't know what happened to this little guy. He's done though. He's tapping out. <laughs> 